I keep it 100, like Borden <laughs> In the streets, but especially when recording Mint tea and a spliff in the morning Then I beat up the beat like doors to a Mormon Mama said the devil find works for bored men And leave trouble, only white men can afford them I try to put my focus on the Lord then But like Hocus, I was back up in the trouble Yo, so what do you guys think about um? Uh, blue, blue face, and uh, what's her name? Rock. Krishan. Krishan. What do you guys think about the relationship? It's, it's toxic. It's love, though. When it's toxic. It's so toxic. It's crazy. It's not romantic. No. <laughs> not romantic. What aspect? <laughs> that she's like, Ratchet she's going so hard for him. Uh, no. It's, it's, uh, damn, I respect that, that she, she goes hard. hard. You respect that she goes I hard. She's a writer. Writer. Mm. But you, you look she's stupid. But she's putting. Mm. She's posting fucking sex tapes on Twitter, but this is my man. Relax, fine. You look dumb. You think she but looks you're dumb? You're a writer, whatever. That's your man. That's your. Okay, why do you say she business. looks? Why do you say she looks dumb? Because you're posting your business with boom boom. Okay, it's prior bad. from that, prior apart from that. You're fighting over someone. That don't give a fuck about you. No, I think he loves her. No, he loves he her. He loves her. He loves her. He does. He does. But he's fucking his baby. He's fucking his baby. But she knows he makes that shit. She's catching a case over bitches, though. Why are you catching a case She knows what she's saying. She's not right. She's not stupid. But the average guy would do that if he could. He has the money to be able to do what he wants without the repercussion. I just feel like she also has issues that she's not dealing with. She's always drunk. You don't think that she's always she drunk. She does like she has some personality. And he's a he's a young nigga growing up too. He's making mistakes too. Yeah, he loves her, but like all that post of her when she's drunk doing throwing up and shit, you're not supposed to be doing that. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? The same, way she, you, the same way she's on her they're just, they're just toxic to each other. And they're all they you did was other. smile. Like, you know what I'm saying? You're weird. Mm, you guys can do things better. They're so, love I can't do it. Sean is Because at the end of the day, she, like, yeah, she's in love and God stupid bless. right now. So if you guys were madly crazy in love, you don't see yourself going that hard for crazy love. No, 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 no. no. Going that hard. Because girls, I find girls go hard for love. No. So. Yeah, going hard as in, like, you know, like, there's a difference between there's certain things you might allow, but yeah, you just sing in your head and, like, and there's like a whole thing. You're not fighting the next girl for your man? I'm not saying I will fight it. I will fight, but if that nigga still going back to every other day, you know I'm in the picture. You know I'm there. You're out of me. That is a problem. Who am I? 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 Who am no, yeah. if it's it, that's a, even a situation where you should do your thing if yeah. your man is the one seeking. Uh, uh, but I'm saying the only reason why you should approach a girl is if she's playing her part and knowing you're there. Mm. You know, you knowing you're in the picture and still doing whatever. Mm. Mm. You know, that's disrespectful. Okay, okay. What do you guys think about Young Miami and uh, P Diddy? I love, I love them. Yeah? Shit. I feel like they have an understanding of what it is in a very mature body. Yeah? I don't even, it doesn't even seem like they're in a relationship. I feel like, exactly. I feel like she's just a young thing and... They're not in a relationship. That's what she has to understand. They're just children. They're not in a relationship. It's like me and a nigga that I meet and we really vibe with each other. We don't want to name it nothing. We're just doing our thing together. We can do our thing elsewhere. It's me and and that's it. So you rather genuine yeah, love. That's yeah, like a friend. Yeah. yeah, we fuck each other. We also fuck each other on a level. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yes, I support you. And they not know everyone has to know There's that. Not. No, but everyone knows. I know. It's just they don't care about anything else. Like, they, they know have, what they got going on. We see old no. water change. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. they can afford it. We don't they see what you guys have going on shit. behind cold doors. You don't spend it. To him, it's probably giving her. A okay, kiss. fine, Maddie. The same vibe that you like between them, would you do that as a mistress? So, the nigga is married, has his life, his kid, family, everything. No, I would. He has you on the side, but you guys have that that dope relationship that you no, were just talking about. I would do. 
that's not for me, cause me when I fuck with somebody, like, I'm a, I'm gonna wanna I'm gonna catch feelings eventually, and I'm gonna wanna be with that person. That's not something I can do personally. Mm. That's not my cup of tea. But anybody I else? I see what it is. Nobody here. Nope. I don't know. That's. You said you don't believe in marriage or whatever, right? So let's say it's a thing where you don't believe in marriage, you're not trying to get married, whatever, but you, you build a connection with somebody, but you know that you could never be the wifey. You don't think you could just ride with that connection and have, plus you're getting the benefits, he's taking care of you, everything. It's not in me. It's not blaze at all. Like, I'd rather just be by myself at that mm. point. I'm doing good for myself. Like, like what are you bringing me? But by yourself, you're not going to get those moments of affection that you said you want from the beginning. That I said I could want. Yeah, you could want. Like, I don't need that. So you're not going to want to... It's not a necessity at all. No, it's like, I hate you. What I'm asking you is like, so you're never gonna want to be intimate with anybody ever? I was. Let me tell you guys. No, but actually, yes, this is yes, 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 Mm. If you meet someone and he's he takes care of you, he's a real friend, and you guys uh uh from time to time, and he just he just you know does everything that a man should do, but you guys don't want to be together like that. You want to fuck with him? Mm -hmm. Like okay, honestly, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like if I'm really in that type of situation and I'm actually like we already yeah. built a connection, yeah. it's like you know that yeah. it was like it more. We've all been there before, right? Yeah, yeah. Like if but I you know, guys it understand it. Like that, I understand. Her I feel like that's what Diddy Ayo Grammy is. It's like an understanding of what it is. But, okay, like, but why can't the understanding be that I'll never be this guy's wife, but we have a good connection. We like we fuck with each other. We do everything. But so that so why you don't you don't personally care if you get married or not? Yeah, so, but I don't. Do so why? That's in a relationship, a baby mama, mm -hmm. and a married fiance. I don't do none of that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's drama. Yeah, I think stretch, that whole fiance stretch, is shit, and it's like. like I don't do anything. That's okay, so you're happen. you're more anti drama. Yes to that. Everyone raise your hand for the anti drama. No, anti drama, anti drama. Raise your hand. I don't like the drama. I don't okay, the drama. So raise your hand. What if it's good? What if his wife doesn't care? Raise your hand. No, no. I so you're I not getting no drama. I don't want to marry nigga though. No. That's not Why are you so quiet? Here. What's going on over there? What his no. wife doing? He's just quiet right now. Being raw. I don't know what listening. You will care. never be number one. Exactly. Every bitch wants to be number one. Mm. You cannot be with you don't be care. She mm. don't care. She don't care. But when mm. you have a wife. But you need to understand that you'll never be number one. Then what? No, no, he no. He wants to cuss you up in front of the gal? It's a thing. Are you dumb? You're getting an upper We're not doing that. They're both getting an upper Because you sat there and you watched that. And you did that. Never no, be that bitch. Can't do them things. I'll never be that bitch. You'll get an uppercut. Unless you're okay with that type of thing. Too much emotion. Too much emotion. If you get someone that's super nice to mind, you're fine. Tone, if you have two girls that are down, but you know you have your wifey, but another girl is down to be the side thing, right? Like, you're down to hold down two girls? Oh, but all that bitch. Mm -hmm. Too much? A lot of men can have two girlfriends. Yeah, exactly. A lot of men can have them cats. Then you shouldn't be thinking I had two girls for like a minute. <laughs> Alright, next one. Um, Pressa and Coilery. Pressa and Coilery. What about that? He looked like a girl. She looked like a girl. You little bitch. She looked like a girl. What are the type pose? Okay, so I feel like. Hey. I feel like Pressa didn't want a girl like Coilery. There, yeah, he mm. could have. Pressa wanted a, 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 a,
He was looking to use her. He was looking to use her. They look like so twins. It, but props to him for that one. Like, like when that one, he's can't get the girl too, too big, like. Yeah. But this is the thing. But he didn't use her right. Because you know why? Because when they broke up, who is a mess anymore? <laughs> what? Who is a mess I didn't give a fuck. After they broke up, we don't hear about anymore. We still hear about Colorado. Because you know why? Because she's, she's a star. That she's that bitch. So you think with that couple, it was more um, a better look for him than for her? But you think you think he's that dumb, fam? For her, man. No, exactly. That's you try to thinking. bag it. You try to bag a chick. He did bag her, and bro. then you fuck. No, no. But I'm trying to say, like, you, you try to bag a chick. He did not press so hard. He's gonna be bag the tank. He needs more leverage. He did not. Nah, but he didn't fuck that. Maybe he, maybe maybe he was rich. He didn't fuck up. Who fucked up? No, but I mean, like, he didn't fuck up as even just being with her, period. Like, he no, was on the shade room. Like, before that, Pressa was literally, Bro, like, dumb, that same song that he made her remix decision. on was not bumping it like that. I was. If you're trying to make it, not like that. that. Sometimes I bump my cubits just she come I was bumping it. <laughs> <laughs> Exactly. Okay, big up Pressa here. Listen, it was a perfect But I'm for everyone. And I saw his. Is Pressa cute? He's pretty. <laughs> gorgeous. Yeah, he looks like a girl. Gorgeous. gorgeous. Would you would you guys go on a date with him? He's gorgeous. Yeah, well, Honestly, well, funny well. story, right? <laughs> so the party that motherfucking Cardi B's sister came out here for, we was mm. me, and me, me and my sister, and he pulled up, and he tried to holler at my sister. My sister. <laughs> she gave him the shoulder. I told my sister, you know what's right? She said. <laughs> I was like, hey. She's like, really? I didn't know. He just was like a regular nigga in the club, but he was really feminine. No offense, but I'm so sorry. Mm -hmm. But she was like, <laughs> You just got this. He knows. He knows. <laughs> he knows. <laughs> everybody used to say, huh? I thought that was a dyke. Yes, Ayo, oh quick game. So pick one. So I'm gonna say two things. You guys have to agree on something and pick one. All right? Okay. Fair. I keep it 100, like boarded <laughs> in the streets, but especially when recorded. Mint tea in the spliff in the morning, then I beat up the beat like doors to a Mormon. Mama said the devil find works for bored men and leave trouble only white men can afford them. I try to put my focus on the Lord, then, but like hocus, I was back up in the trouble.